what is going on guys let me get a zoom out here what's going on guys welcome to today's video jesus i hate you're recording a video and people are just texting you or whatever texting you like crazy for this elections bro it's crazy anyways what's going on guys welcome back to today's video on um, today's video is going to be i'm going to try to make a 10 minute video hopefully we are doing two little installs easiest things ever it is the jdm coin pocket i have it right here let's see if we get a little uh, focus on it there it is little jdm coin pocket that goes in the blanks the blank spot next to the cruise control on the rsx and I also have the two spoon lug nuts that I was missing uh, because I had an incomplete set. I want to show you guys the difference in color. If you guys could tell, one is a little bit darker, which is this one, and this one's a little bit lighter. I'm going to show you guys what not to do with these lug nuts. You see how they're kind of, they kind of have markings from like a gun or like an air gun or like a really hard socket or whatever that... You know that they put on it or uh, i don't know i don't know what they did with it they definitely hit it really hard or the spoon lug nuts are really not the hardest material or not, they're not the best material when it comes to like uh they'll get scratched easily so my suggestion is that you don't ever 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 hit this with an air gun screw it in by hand and then when you get to the very end where it's already snug and tight give it a torque you don't need to give that you don't need to get those screws and air gun tight you're putting a lot more pounds of pressure than what you'll ever that don't than what I'll ever need it they'll ever need because I think it needs only like 87 or 88 pounds of pressure I'm not sure I gotta look it up for the RSX what it is anyway so we're doing that which is the JDN coin pocket we're doing the spoon lug nuts but it has been raining like crazy you obviously can't see out the window but it's gonna be raining the whole day it's like 50% chance of rain the whole freaking day is I just been watching like YouTube videos like eliminate or whatever because I finished work early and I'm just here like just hanging out I don't even want to go to the gym this is like weather's like super depressing but anyways uh the shop is already up the products are here the products have been ordered i already have them here in stock ready to ship i was shipping out some orders today the animation the little dc5 animation that dc5 animation is limited runs i only got i only had 20 there's about 13 left i sold about seven of them i sold seven of them no i sold six and then i kept one which I put in the computer. So I only got 13 left. The other ones are here, the circle decals, the eight by 1.5, 1.25 or 2.75, which is the longer one that says JDM Legends. I am ordering more to have it in restock. The shirt should be getting here Friday and I wanna drop a nice bomb ass video for like the little merch. I know people have told me like, yo, it's a little early to get merch. You only have like 5,000 subscribers in the channel. It doesn't really matter to me. I, it keeps me entertained, it keeps me, ha it keeps me happy and and like I said, it keeps my mind entertained from doing stuff and recording videos and bringing, bringing good content for you guys. But anyways, even at 5,000 subscribers, you guys still support and you guys have bought. So I appreciate each and every one of you who supported the channel and have bought some merch. This Using this vlog camera is kind of weird because like I'm supposed to look at this lens right here, but I keep looking over here, which is like where you can see yourself. But anyways, it's not like you could put a monitor in the lens. But And I do have another lens coming in, which is going to record amazing. So yeah, got the spoon lug nuts, complete set. The Enki's RPF ones will definitely be completed now. Those are the Me Too wheels. Some guy commented on on my uh, Instagram, I believe it was Instagram or YouTube, and so I was like, "Oh, you bought the Me Too wheels? Yes, I bought the Me Too wheels. But those Me Too wheels look a lot better than the RSX. Plus, I have the plus twenty two uh, offset, which is a little bit different than than what a lot of people run on the RSX. A lot of people don't run the plus twenty two. So I'll see you guys now. Let me go ahead and install it. I'll I'll wait a little bit for the rain to come down, and if not, then. I'll have to wait for it to uh, come down in order for me to go outside and record it. I'll see you guys now. Remember to subscribe, hit the thumbs up for your boy. Let's go. so this side is already done don't ever use a torque wrench to loosen 
the nuts here from the the tires or don't ever use a, a, a torque wrench to loosen anything i'm using it because they are very loose so it, it wasn't that much of a <clears throat> of a pressure that i had to put on it but don't ever use it because you could mess up the torque wrench i'm gonna go ahead and tie these up real quick just i got these at i got these set up at uh 80 86 86 pounds of pressure and this is in order to not scratch the spoon sport lug nuts this is what i use don't ever like i said hit it with an air gun this one didn't click it needs to click there it is Okay, this one. All right, so they're on already. I'm being very delicate. Let me show you what happens. As you can see how those are a little scratch. You can see it like on the inside there, how's it a little scratch. I'll show you another one. Oh, here it is, maybe this one. Let me see if we get a focus here. Like you can see, Okay, what's going on? And 50 was supposed to be great at auto-focusing. Yeah, I gotta touch the screen on it. There you go. What is it? It's trying to capture something else. Okay, anyway, so you can just tell those are a little scratch there. I guess I put an air gun to it. I got the rest inside, I gotta get them. I'm clean the wheels real good. Show you guys how good they came out. So they are on, two rears on, front one's on, and I only got three left. So that means I still need to order two more for my CV. I forgot that I gave four, uh, I gave four away for another project. Damn it. Anyways, the car's not running. I mean, not that the car's not running. I'm not driving it much now because I'm still fixing the windows, which I also got to take out the two 10 millimeters that are inside the door panels and I got to adjust the window, but that's how it looks. I hope you guys like the little cinematography I did there. I always like doing those little things. Anyways, let me get back to uh, putting the other three that are left. I'll come back to you guys. All right, guys. So this was fairly easy. Basically, I just very thin screwdriver, stick it around here, pop it out, pop the other one back in, and pop this in. I don't have any coins because I definitely don't have any coins. Never carry coins since I was like 15 years old that I started making money. I've never had any coins in my pocket. So this will definitely be just a little showpiece. 